Hey guys, welcome back to Data with Dominic. And in today's video, we're going to be looking at the between function in PySpark. All right. So the between between function helps us to return uh, the rows that lie between a certain range of values for a specific column. All right. So let's dive into the demo so you can understand that more clearly. I've got basically the Databricks community edition set up here with the first thing I'm doing being importing a CSV file into a data frame and then just displaying the data frame. So as you can see, it's quite a simple data frame. Just ID, first name, last name, email, gender, and marks column. And what we want to do is, suppose we want to return the rows which fall between a specific uh, range of values in the ID column. So say between three and six, we want to return those rows. So what we do is, we just do a df.filter once we filter the data frame that we want to filter, uh, we specify the conditions. And that is done using the between function. So inside parenthesis, we specify the column on which we want to uh, filter the data, which is df.id. And then we do a dot between and then specify the range of values. And this is three to six in this situation. And remember that these are inclusive. So the rows with values three and six will be included in the returned results. Mm -hmm. And then we're just wrapping that in a display so that we can get the output. So as you can see, this is the output that we got. So we've got basically rows three to six and all their details have been returned. So it's a very helpful function, which is the dot between function. And then just one more thing I wanted to point out to you guys is we can also use the df dot select and then specify the same df id dot between three to six values and what it does is actually it returns a new column or an ideated column where every uh, row is evaluated to true or false based on this between function so as you can see everything is false except between three to six you've got a true value right there so this can be useful for you guys depending on the scenario that you want to work with uh, so just remember df.select and then specify the same df.id.between to get this entire column with true or false flag values. And if you just want to return the the frames, the, the rows which have values within the range, we use the df.filter and then in th inside parenthesis we use the df.id.between and specify the range. And it doesn't just work for numbers, it works for uh, strings as well. So I want to return the rows where the first name falls between the letters H and R. So here what I'm doing is just specifying H and R after the dot between within double quotes. And then it returns all values where the first name is a letter between H and R. H and R are included, not got any names with R. So you can see that if I change this to O, O bed should still be included. Okay, so okay, so I don't think the second one is included because of how strings work. But yeah, first uh, starting range value is included for sure. All right. So, anyways, that's it. Thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, comment, and hit the bell icon. And we'll see you in the next one.